มาเลยดิ
making weapons for the family that killed my father. Family that tried to kill me. I've been getting ready. I never knew what for, but I've always known I'd know it when it comes. You might want to bring one of those swords. I don't know much about swinging swords. But this... This I know. Well, it's still a weapon. You don't say it. <laughs> Keep your father's name to yourself. Situation's complicated enough already. Who should I say I am? I told you, Clovis, if we don't get out of here soon, you someone's there. gonna... No weapons, friends. I promise. What can I do for you? Is that your boat? It is. The docks are that way. That they are. I try to stay away from them, to avoid good men such as yourselves. Still five gold dragons? <laughs> you joking? <laughs> you must be even older than you look. Fifteen. Fifteen? A piece. I can't say it was a pleasure doing business with you. What's in the boat? Not more gold. Wine. Mm. I like wine. Or oh, hands. Come have a look. Fermented crab. What? Fermented crab. One bucket of this triples the brothel's earnings for the week. A man thinks he's done. He's ready to go back to his loving family. But before he gets his breeches up, his lady of the hour pops a tiny spoon of that into his mouth. Five minutes later, he's back in the race. Here. Have a taste. I'd hurry to your favorite establishment, or you'll put a hole in that chain mail. anymore until you see how the first bite hits you. That dwarf. Where'd you get that scar? Fisher, some men you just can't teach. We well, was looking for a dwarf with a scar like that a while back. Perhaps there's some arrangement? Arrangement. You're going to arrange to pay us more than Queen Sir. <laughs> You're gonna get caught anyway. This is Gendry. The do. Go, go, go! Why are you here? I'm your brother. <laughs> I met with Tyrion. And? <laughs> what did our brother have to say? Daenerys wants to meet. To discuss her surrender. To discuss an armistice. She just won a great victory. Why would she want a truce now? Because an army of dead men is marching on the Seven Kingdoms. Tyrion claims you'll have proof. <laughs> Are you going to punish him? Tyrion. Ron. He betrayed you. She knew. He set up a meeting without your knowledge or consent. 
Do you think anything of importance happens in this city without me knowing? You let it happen. Why? I've come to believe that an accommodation with the Dragon Queen could be in our immediate interest. She has the numbers. If we want to beat her, we have to be clever. We have to fight her like Father would have. Dead men, dragons, and dragon queens. <laughs> That's a good book. <laughs> stands in our way. That's a good book title. We will defeat it. For ourselves, for us. For this. Father used to say about people. The lion does not concern himself with the opinions of the sheep. Mm. So she's pregnant again. Man, JB Seed, man. Such strong, much wow. <laughs> Never betray me again. Well, he technically didn't. We're leaving today. The king's got a lot on his mind. I understand. He doesn't need to be thinking about harboring the bastard of a dead king. You don't have to worry. You're just Clovis. A smith who's come to pay his respects before he heads off to work at the Winterfell Forges. Understood. Begging your pardon, your grace. You survived King's Landing. Yet again. Your grace. This is Prince Gendry, your grace. I'm Robert Baratheon's son. Bastard son. He was meant to keep that to himself. Our fathers trusted each other. Why shouldn't we? I saw your father once at Winterfell. Mm -hmm. I met yours in my shop. You're a lot leaner. You're a lot shorter. <laughs> gee, gee. I grew up on stories about them. And all I ever knew is that they fought together and won. Sir Davos told me where you're going, your grace, and why. Let me come with you. Don't be a fool. You're not a soldier. No, but I'm a fighter. And you won't be needing a smith with a sword like that. You know how to use one? Oh, that's a problem. I prefer a hammer. <laughs> He can handle himself. We could use the help. As my father used to say, it's better to be a coward for a minute than dead for the rest of your life. I owe you my life. Twice over. If what you said is true about what's up there, I can't wait out this war. Yeah, nobody mind me. All I've ever done is live to a ripe old age. <laughs> Nobody might be. All I've ever done is live to a ripe old age. You may not believe it. I've missed you, Mormon. Nobody glowers quite like you. <laughs> not even Grey Worm. the coin the slaver gave me when I suggested he free us and pay us, remember? It was supposed to last us the rest of our lives. It has. Take it with you. But bring it back. Our queen needs you. We should be better at saying farewell by now. <laughs> uh, Your grace, eh?
If I don't return, at least you won't have to deal with the king in the north anymore. <laughs> I've grown used to him. I wish you good fortune in the wars to come, Your Grace. Like I remember, like a uh, canoe boat that I went on with my dad. And it's fucking heavy, man. I almost lost these because like it kept toppling over. Yeah, not not a not a good memory actually. Do you know how many steps there are in the citadel? Because it didn't like I had to catch it 15, with my foot. Fifteen thousand seven hundred and eighty-two. True story. Guess how many windows are in the great sept of Baylor? 20,000. None anymore. That's oh. true. <laughs> this high sept on Maynard, he recorded everything. He even recorded his own bowel movements. Everything. What does annulment mean? It's when a man sets aside his lawful wife. Maynard says here that he issued an annulment for Prince Ragger and remarried him to someone else at the same time in a secret ceremony in Dawn. Is that a common thing oh, in the South? Is these maesters. <laughs> they set me to the task of preserving that man's wind accounting and annulments and bowel movements for all eternity, while the secret to defeating the Night King is probably sitting on some dusty shelf somewhere completely ignored. But that's all right, isn't it? We can all become slavering, murderous imbeciles in thrall to evil incarnate as long as we can have access to the full records of High Septum Maynard's 15,782 shits. <laughs> Steps. <laughs> that number was Sad. You know Bran sees everything, right? I'm just saying. And also Arya, because she's right there. Hashtag disappearing act. Mm. 
But she's really good at the assassin slash spy job now. I found it, my lord. It took some searching. Means the Lewin's archives aren't very thorough. Are you sure this is the only copy in Winterfell? Uh, yes, my lord. Lady's dog thanks you for your service. I love the hallway though. And I love that she knows how to pick a lock. Underneath the mattress. That's right. That's what I meant. There we go. Mm. I don't really read that because it's in cursive and my reading of cursive letters is very very bad are there now? Two. And you need to convince the one with the dragons or the one who fucks her brother? Both. How many men did you bring? Not enough. The big woman. We were hoping some of your men could help. Hmm. I'll be staying behind. I'm a liability out there as you well know. You are. <laughs> no holding back. really want to go out there. Again. You're not the only ones. You're not the only ones. The scouts found them a mile south of the wall. Said they were on the way here. But they caught one. You're the Hound. I saw you once at Winterfell. They want to go beyond the wall too. We don't want to go beyond the wall, we have to. Our Lord told us that the Great War is coming. Don't trust him. Don't trust any of them. They're the Brotherhood. And the last thing their lord told them to do was sell me to a red witch to be murdered. Doris.
I hardly recognized you. This is your moment. No one give me anything to drink down here. I haven't been feeling like myself. You're a fucking moment. Like the last Lord Commander. He was my father. He hunted us. Oh, like animals. You returned a favor, as I recall. Here we all are. <laughs> Here we all are. At the edge of the world. At the same moment. Heading in the same direction for the same reason. Our reasons aren't your reasons. It doesn't matter what we think our reasons are. There's a greater purpose at work. And we serve it together. Whether we know it or not. We may take the steps, but the Lord of Light... For fuck's the... sake, will you shut your hole? Are we coming with you or not? Don't you want to know what we're doing? Is it worse than sitting in a freezing cell waiting to die? He's right. We're all on the same side. How can we be? We're all breathing. I was like, yeah, I was gonna finish soon, so. Look at this, though. <laughs> like grabbing stuff and all that. And yeah, they just go into the wind, don't they? Yep. And that's the end, isn't it? Because we're pretty close. Yeah, I knew it. It's it's classic. Uh, it's classic technique, man. To stop at the at that like mist thingy. Uh, so yeah, guys, that's about it. Um, I really enjoyed this episode. I think one of the things that uh, happened most here is. You know the reunions in in the last episode as well. So what we what what we are gonna see later on is probably them them finding the the Night's Watch army and then kind of kidnapping the um the one of the armies. And uh, my friend said like technically Caitlyn Stark is supposed to be in the Night's Watch uh in the Night's army in the Night Army's uh army. So I think that will be something there maybe I I don't know yet, um, but uh, yeah Peter Peter Baelish Littlefinger is on um, Arya Stark and that's gonna be something he's playing on in this uh, in the next episode as well and maybe he's gonna maybe he's going to like confront her about it or maybe not we we I'm not really sure yet, um, but yeah that's about it um, I definitely think this is uh more of a like a padded episode like a filler sort of where it's kind of like the other side of like reunions like uh you know Tyrion meeting up with Jamie and I think like Jamie didn't really give a chance for Tyrion to explain himself when why he killed his father um but yeah I definitely think I want to see more of Daenerys like thinking and all that like 
but also you know the the flip side is very interesting to see like Cersei and she's pregnant again like I so that's gonna be something that is uh, playing maybe you know the baby is kinda gonna be fed to the Night King I, I'm not really sure yet so yeah guys that's about it and I will see you guys in the next episode which is probably gonna be uh, um, the uh, Rick and Morty one so uh, yeah I will see you then bye <laughs>